Howdy champs, my name is Mohit Manuja of qualitylessons.net and today I'm going to show you how to shuffle an array using the sort in JavaScript. Now sorting is not the same as shuffle but we can tweak the sorting just that tad and we can achieve the result. Now the shuffling that you create this way is uh, a loose shuffle is not the best kind of shuffle see shuffling depends on the method or the algorithm you use the best known algorithm is the um, just give me a sec let me Fisher Yates yep Fisher Yates algorithm and I had shown you how to do that in the, the last tutorial today I'm gonna use sort and create a loose shuffle basically it's a weak shuffle but it's still a shuffle gets you what you want so it depends on your requirement it may suit you, you your need but it's very, 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 the code is very concise very short and hence I want to show it to you it may be useful for many of you for many of your projects right so I'm using codepen.io it's an online editor it has HTML CSS and JS panels where you can put your jQuery or JavaScript I'll be using only JavaScript it's a very short code surprisingly so first let me sort it okay this is how you sort it and then let's display the result to the document so document dot write and write what fruits am I right I'm sorry this there should be no parents out here it's a variable right so I sorted it in the alphabetical uh, alphabetical <laughs> what's called sorry alphabetical order so apple banana mango and orange O comes after M comes after B which comes after A right so that's that's the the plain sorting but what you can do is out here you can pass a function a compare function which is an optional function and depending on whether what's return is negative zero or positive we can have some variations going with the sort method right let's see what I mean by that so let's pass the optional function the optional compare function okay so function this is the bare bone structure and then return 0.5 minus math dot random okay I'll explain this a little later let me first save it and let's refresh and let's see what how this actually affects <coughs> it's a very short code I'm sure you have to agree so instead of saying banana orange apple and mango it actually says orange banana mango and apple let me tell you this method works for not only for strings but also for numbers okay so orange banana and here we have banana orange mango and apple right but you can already sense that it's a ki kind of a weak um, uh, a shuffle because see you know banana has just moved once you know one place from where it was and the same with mango so the values tend to stick to the extreme ends you know sometimes that's why it's kind of a weak shuffle now I was saying the sort behaves in a different way depending on what this optional function returns this returns a value which is 0.5 minus math.random now, what's math.random going to return? What's, what's math.random going to generate? It's going to generate uh, a number between 0 and 1. Not including 0 and not including 1. And if you say 0 0.5 minus math.random, let's it could be math or random so uh, 0.5 minus 0.6 
that will give you a negative number if, if it's min, uh, 0 0.5 minus 0 0.5 that will be 0 sometimes it will be um, a positive number sometimes it will be a negative number sometimes it will be 0 so whatever is returned could be either negative positive or neutral basically 0 depending on that the sort behavior is altered and that creates that pseudo shuffle it's actually a real shuffle but I'm calling it pseudo because um, it's not fake actually it's kind of weak so as I said it completely depends on your requirement maybe you're okay with it maybe you're not okay with it right so let's do a reload and see the results but you can employ this method if your need is not very stringent so banana orange mango apple uh, here only mango and apple have been swapped right let's do a reload once again mango which is in the last position actually goes in the first position banana orange apple now this time it's been you know shuffled very nicely okay so guys I hope you found this information useful and I hope the grapes are not sour but sweet depends on how you look at it and depends on what you really want you have a good day bye bye peace